I am in the elevator. This could go one of two ways. She could be really excited, relieved, or super upset. Or both. Who knows? Las Vegas and we are now in Utah. We're at a campground called Castle Rock. We got here pretty late last night around 11:30. It's now 8 a.m. That's why I'm talking a little bit quieter. Uh, but once we got here, we ran into a bit of a problem with our van. The van is not starting and we have no idea why. So we called up AAA and that's what I'm doing right now, waiting on this road. But in the meantime, I'm taking in some really nice views. <music> talk a little bit louder the address that I gave the tow company was incorrect um, but I corrected it there must have been some miscommunication between the service provider and the towing service and so the guy went to the wrong address so now it's another 30 minutes waiting to see if this is even gonna work I really hope it does but in the meantime the family is up. Let's go check in. Good morning, good morning. Oh, hey. Oh. Hey. Hi. Hi. Right. You slept so good, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Hey. Oh. <laughs> Update, the jump did not work. We are still here at our campground. It's now 10 a.m. Uh, it's looking a little grim right now, I'm not gonna lie. And it's pretty difficult to even just document this right now, but we're gonna power through and it's all gonna work out in the end. I had to call back and request a tow now. We're going to go to the closest city, um, some civilization, and we're gonna take it there and see what happens next. Okay, well, after all that Sega this morning from 12 a.m. in the middle of nowhere, beautiful Utah, <laughs> our precious camper van is up on the tow truck. And where are we headed to? Home. Yeah. I want to go home. <laughs> All right, situation update. We towed the RV about 100 miles, 130 miles south of the direction that we were supposed to be traveling. Basically, we're heading back to Las Vegas. We just got to the hotel, we dropped off the RV. And guys, you are not going to believe this. This RV just powered on. I'm telling you. I haven't told Mariah. I don't know how I'm supposed to tell her. This thing was lit up like a Christmas tree. It's all gone. I don't know what, I don't know how, I don't know why, <sighs> but we just spent like a couple hundred bucks to tow it out of there. Thankfully, I mean, we're in a good spot. We have a lot of restaurants. We're at a hotel. We don't know where this was gonna take us. <sighs> it's a whole thing. We will explain this a lot more, but right now, RV, she lives. Are we going to continue on with our journey? Let's find out. I am in the elevator. This could go one of two ways. She could be really excited, relieved, or super upset, or both. Who knows? Hi, Bobby. Hi. Hi. I have really great news. 
Oh. I have good news. Okay. And really bad news. Okay. What do you want first? Um, give me the bad first. We paid a lot of money. It was something, you know, over four hundred, almost five hundred dollars for the tow. Okay. Okay. That I kind of knew about. So I'm good with that. Uh huh. The car is on. It turned on. It's been running. Uh, the only thing that's on the dash right now is a check engine light. What? Yeah. Oh my god! Why? This I don't is understand. raw and uncut, you guys. I don't understand. Yeah. After all those dramatics being held up in a hotel, we are back on the road. There are no emergency lights on the dash. It was all so strange, but <laughs> you know what? It's okay, it's all gonna be worth it when we make it to Canada and Aiden finally meets his great grandparents and his aunts and his uncles. Woo! So, we're excited. Yeah, that's where we headed to next. Colorado! Let's do it! <laughs> We decided to make an impromptu stop on our way to our next destination a little bit reluctantly because we decided to do it off the grid on a gravel road again which as you know did not work out for us the first time so we are on last chance road i cannot make that up i looked it up on google maps that's the place that we're at right now our van is still running as of this moment <laughs> and we just stopped for some lunch with some gorgeous views behind us I have no idea where we are because the cell surface isn't the greatest either. So please. We're living on the edge over here, guys. We really are. We're not <laughs> learning our lessons at all, but you know what? We're just taking it in strides, right, babe? We are just taking in this beautiful view and enjoying life and taking time to just be grateful. Grateful that we are where we are right now in this moment. Summer day play done. Gold, gold, sun down. Fire, fire. Hey, come here. Look, look what mama. You didn't change it, turn the page. I shine. <laughs> Okay, so we made it to our third state. We are now finally in Colorado. So far, so good. No issues with the van whatsoever. We made it to our campground. We're just having some good old breakfast right now. Mm -hmm. We got some Nutella, apples, honey, and granola. <laughs> made by yours truly. Yeah. Oh. Baby Aiden. 
And we got a gorgeous view in the background there of the Colorado National Monument. And we are off to our next location, so stay tuned. Bye! Bye.